Hey kids, this is August 16th, 2022, 8.31 p.m., episode 1783. This is the uh, second video for the day. I did the CNN one earlier, and this is what I did this morning. I didn't have my idea when I woke up, but I knew that I wanted to do something on Rudy. Um, I had a couple other things I was thinking about, but I thought, let's go ahead and do Rudy, you know? Because Rudy's just too much fun. How do I not do Rudy? And either everybody else felt the same way that I did, or maybe I influenced them slightly, but I saw like uh, 10 other Rudy cartoons today, um, which I saw one of them that I really, really liked. The other ones I thought were pretty good, uh, but one of them I, I really, really dug by Nick Anderson. It was great. Um, I, I would have done that one instead of this one. <laughs> I thought it was so good. Um, and it was quicker too. I don't know what I did here with this big black spot. Uh, I had the whole thing zoomed up because I was doing the Georgia lettering down there, Georgia Grand Jury. And when I looked up, I was like, ah, I gotta hit the reverse button until that thing's gone. I'm not really doing all this lettering. Um, but this Rudy is just hilarious. He, he is a shell of his former self and there's just something wrong with this guy. I, but I don't know if it's all mental as much as it might just be that his narcissism has consumed him so much that it's just eaten him alive. Um, that's what I think has happened. Uh, I mean, he's running around, his hair's dripping, he's at the Four Seasons sort of landscape outside a porn shop, he's farting and lying and lying in court and the state legislatures, and now he's probably going to go to prison in Georgia. Speaking of prison, Robert Cotino said that I suggested DJT should go to prison, but failed to say which one. New York, Georgia, or U.S., many counts. Yeah, there are several counts that they're looking at with the federal with the Department of Justice. It's not just this Fredo Mar-a-Lago. They're still looking at, at the stuff we're trying to overturn an election. Uh, Trump's in trouble in Georgia. And you know, the, um, he's in trouble in New York. Uh, there, I think there is one criminal probe in New York. Uh, and now, but the stuff that happens to him might may not send him to prison. It might just be like up in New York where someone else is taking the fall. Weaselberg, Weselberg is gonna go to prison for five months. Donald Trump's not going to prison for all that tax stuff with the Trump Corporation, <laughs> Trump Organization, but someone else is. Now, this is like a personal thing for him, like like he took payments and stuff that he didn't pay taxes on, you know, like tuition and everything for his kids. But, uh, but, but this just might be an example that Trump has other people go take the fall for him. Um, the District of Columbia might bring up some charges against Trump as well. Uh, because, you know, he broke the law and there. They have court, courts and you, you can't break the law in District of Columbia. You know, it's not, it's not just a, a, a lawless frontier there. Um, so, who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Uh, I, I think I have my subject for tomorrow, but I haven't written it yet. But I, I kind of think I have the basic concept I'm going to go with. Uh, I think. Hey, uh, golly time. Uh. I also was on the phone tonight for an hour with another cartoonist, uh, one from out in California, who wanted to ask me some questions about stuff in the business. So, and that was enjoyable. I'm getting more and more of those phone calls lately. It's like cartoonists want to talk to me on the phone and stuff. Guys, talk later. Bye. Bye, bye, bye.